Welcome back, everybody. Now, after tonight, I can honestly say we will have had about every celebrity on earth on this show. My next guests include the king of celebrity impressionists, Rich Little. And tonight, he's been with us more than any of the guests we've had. We absolutely love Rich Little at this show. And tonight, he's going to be joined by fellow Las Vegas impressionist, Rich Natoli, who's star of the show Voices of a Generation, presenting the ultimate presidential press conference. Would you please welcome Rich Little and Rich Natoli? Well, this is uh, actor Robert Wagner. That's right. I have a question for President Ronald Reagan. Mr. President, when would you declare a person legally dead? When the heart stops beating or when the brain stops functioning? Oh, well, I would have to say when the heart stops beating. Good Lord, if you determine it by the brain stops functioning, you would wipe out half the Senate. And Mr. President, one more question. What do you think about women astronauts? Well, I think it's great for the country because if the crew ever got lost in space, at least a woman would ask for directions. Well, this is Clint Eastwood. I'm not sure if I had six questions or only five. So I'm just gonna ask one. My question is for President Nixon. Can you tell us about your childhood? Well, when I was a little liar growing up in Whittier, California, <laughs> nobody liked me. I was a loser. Uh, I really was. I, I, I never did anything right. I used to wet my thumb and suck my bed. <laughs> but I was never a boozer, though. I, I, I was never into liquor, never. Well, a couple of drinks I, that I did uh, indulge in. Uh, a subpoena colada, I drank one of those. <laughs> and an impeachment brandy. <laughs> and uh, next we go to President Jimmy Carter. This is Mr. Haney from Green Acres. <laughs> and I have a few genuine questions for President Carter. Uh, President Carter, what do you like about President Joe Biden? He makes me look good. And what do you like about Vice President Cam Eula Harris? He makes Joe Biden look good. <laughs> that was funny. I, I wrote that myself. <laughs> and Mr. President, do you think Joe Biden's presidency is picking up speed? Oh, of course. Things always pick up speed when they're going downhill. <laughs> This is Bob Hope, and I want to tell you, I've known every president on this stage. Isn't that something? I want to tell you, my favorite was George Bush Sr. Isn't it true, Mr. President, that you love to fly? In fact, you, you parachuted out of a plane 30 years ago. Okay, okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. That's, that's a good question. Yeah, good to see you, good to see you. And that's true, that's true, you know? And I was... 
scared to death. I really was. I was terrified, you know. There I was up on the plane. I didn't know what the heck to do, you know. And I turned to the pilot, and I said to the pilot, I said, well, what, what am I going to do? He said, well, Mr. President, you put on the parachute, right, okay, then you jump out of the plane, and then you wait for a bit, and then when you're 20 feet before the ground, you know, you pull the cord. So that's the way to do it. Uh, 20 feet? 20 feet from the ground? Yeah, 20 feet. That way you don't have far to fall. <laughs> well, this is, uh, this is Jay Leno here. And uh, my question is uh, for uh, President Clinton. Uh, President Clinton, uh, what do you attribute your long marriage to Hillary to? Well, every week, every week, we would go to the same restaurant every week. Hillary would go Mondays and Wednesdays, and I would go Thursdays and Fridays. <laughs> well, this is Donald J. Trump, and I'm right here. First of all, Joe, how's your campaign going? My name is, uh... Hey, you chumps out there. Hey, hey, man. Hey, man. My, na my name is, uh, is, uh, uh, oh, God. Um, my name, my name, um, um, Joe Biden. Joe Biden. Joe Biden. That's my name. You know, President Harris and myself are doing an outstanding, an outstanding job as president and first lady, I mean senator, uh, 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 whatever it is. Uh, we're, doing the, we're doing the work right now of uh, seven people, seven people. Grumpy, dopey, sleepy. <laughs> oh, <man. Okay. laughs> there they are. All right, I got to tell you, my wife and I went to Vegas to see Rich Little. It was fabulous, one of the best shows we have ever seen. To get tickets to his show and autobiography little by little and to book Rich Natoli and learn more about his new movie, Faith Wins, Go to Huckabee.tv. We'll get you connected. You'll want to be. Thank you guys for being here. We're so excited to have you. First time you've done this together, isn't it? Yes. Well, it won't I'm, be the last. I'm working, on on your, <laughs> I'm working on your voice now. <laughs> you go. I'm, I'm going to get the governor down. There you go. I'm working on it. And we'll have him back on her eyes. I'm having, I'm having trouble sleeping. I don't know what to do. I've just... I can help you with that. Okay. But well, right I've now, I've been listening to Joe Biden's speeches. Keith Bilbrey is going to do his best announcer impression. He'll tell us what's coming up next. Go oh, ahead, Keith. Stop laughing. <laughs>